Good afternoon, everyone, and welcome to the first ever Daily Blitz for a college football game. It is Daily Blitz 01 for EA Sports College Football. And in this notification Daily from Blitz, social, Cosius Goala 30. We're going to take a look at the main menu interface for EA Sports College Football 01 because there are some things to be aware of. We are waiting for the main menu to come up. Entering main menu screen, there Dynasty is. is selected. Okay, so we are in the main menu screen. We are on the home tab. And everything in each tab, I will say, is arranged in a vertical list. And I think EA did a good job uh, with these menus. I will also say, that when you reach the bottom or of a menu, or you wrap around to the other side of a menu, uh, in most menus, the controller will vibrate to indicate as such. Very nice touch by EA in that regard as well. So let's take a look at the uh, interface here on the home tab. We have Dynasty mode, which is the mode that we played last. Ultimate team is selected. Ultimate team is also listed here. Road to the CFP is selected. Road to the CFP. This is a ranked, uh, this is an online mode where you play against other players. Road to glory is selected. Road to glory. This is similar to superstar mode in Madden, but apparently from what I've heard, it's better. Accessibility is selected. We have accessibility Accessibility here in the uh, main tab, Dynasty and is selected. it wraps back up to Dynasty. Uh, these are all the modes that are frequently played, uh, or suggested, I should say, uh, by the game. Let's hit our right bumper, or R1 button, and see what else we have. Play now is selected. Okay, so this is the game modes tab. And we have play now, which is offline. Play friend is selected. Uh, there's also play a friend. Dynasty is selected. Uh, Dynasty is again here. Again, this is a game mode. Road to glory is selected. Road to glory. Ultimate team is selected. Ultimate team. Road to the CFP is selected. Road to the CFP. Play now is selected. And back to play now. We're gonna go to the next tab. Mini games is selected. This is the um, training tab. And we have mini games. Open practice is selected. Open practice. Mini games is selected. Back to mini games. So this is where you can try out the the uh, mini games if you are so inclined. They have offensive, defensive, and special teams. Uh, mini games. Let's go to the next tab. Download center is selected. This is the This is the create and share tab. And in this one we have what as it said earlier, download files. Manage files is selected. Manage Rosters files. Rosters is selected. Rosters. Custom playbooks is selected. Custom playbooks. Download center is selected. And the download center. I apologize for that. Let's go on. Game settings is selected. This is the settings tab, and we have game settings. Game controls is selected. Game controls. Glad to see that there. Assign auto subs is selected. Assign auto subs. Accessibility is selected. Accessibility. Game settings is selected. And back to game settings. And we have next is the more tab. Profile is selected. We have profile. Abilities is selected. This is the abilities glossary. Extras is selected. Extras. Profile is selected. And back to profile. So all of these are arranged vertically. There is no grid pattern here. There is no, um, you know, ununiform tables here. EA laid it out in a nice, clean interface. No frills. No additives, it is all natural. No preservatives, just straight vertical menus arranged into tabs. This is a look at the main interface, our next daily blitz. What are we doing next, love? Um, we had discussed it. Oh, well, we talked about doing Dynasty. 
I see it's gonna probably be a series video. Ah. Well, I think what we'll try to do for our next Daily Blitz is to take you through the process of starting the game for the first time. That will be our next Daily Blitz.